What's up everybody, Eric with Trout's Fly Fishing in Denver. On this installment of Getting Started in Fly Tying, we're gonna talk about how to palmer wrap. Um, so the example we're gonna use today is palmering a hackle. Um, Typically it's feathers that you palmer, but there's, you know, you can do it with, with materials in a dubbing loop. Um, there's a lot of different things that you palmer. The whole idea with palmering is that you're wrapping the material around the hook shank, but you're leaving space. Um, so you're not trying to fill the whole thing. You're just trying to, you know, I mean, even think about a zebra midge. Technically that's a, a palmer just because you're leaving spaces in between those wraps. Um, so basically uh, what we want to do when we palmer uh, particularly with hackles um, if you can use a really long hackle feather it makes it easier because with a longer feather you don't necessarily have to use hackle pliers because um, it's easy to hang on to that um, but basically all we're going to do is we want to orient so that that first wrap is at the back of where we want to start and then we're just going to move up leaving space in between each one of those wraps. And when we get up to where we want to end the palmer, just bring our thread around, pinch that tag end of the material. Um, usually three wraps or so, clip the material off. Um, so now you can see we have a nice palmered hackle where there's spaces in between. Uh, woolly buggers, um, probably the most common thing you're going to use a palmered hackle on, but you know, hack hackling under an elk hair caddis, um, stimulator, a lot of that, those are palmered hackles. Um, so that is how we do palmered wraps. Uh, thanks for tuning in. Check out our YouTube channel. Have a great day.